All right, welcome to the course. My name is John Elder from Kodobi.com and I'll be your instructor today. In this course, we're gonna build this cool little weather app that looks up air quality. So like uh, ozone layer, or ozone numbers, uh, air particle numbers, things like that. And you can see right here, I've got it pulled up for Las Vegas. This is the default, this is where I live. So it shows, it gives you a score, 43, and it translates that into uh, a special you know, word, good, moderate, hazardous, etc. Uh, it shows a different color based on you know your number here so we can enter a different zip code up here we can search out zip codes and you can see here near st louis it's moderate the air quality is 100 uh, it has a little spiel on what is the air quality and that changes based on the numbers and very cool so it's just a very basic app but we're gonna use django and python to build this and you'll see how to connect to a third-party api that's the important thing about this course you'll learn how to connect to apis how to get data from them how to pull them back into your app do things to them you know output them onto the screen do, do different things based on what the api brings back and you know do some logic and stuff like that and it should be a lot of fun so uh, if you have any questions along the way absolutely be, feel free to drop me a line any way you can here wherever you're taking the course there's usually a comment section or you can send me a message directly any way you can to sort of get in contact with me that's awesome i'm in vegas i'm here answering questions all day every day uh, just sort of realize i'm in vegas so if you're on the other side of the world and it's during the day i'm probably sleeping i'll uh, go ahead and answer your question as soon as i wake up the next day but just sort of keep that in mind but i'm pretty good about answering questions at least within a few hours it's certainly within the day uh, and if you don't hear from me by then something is horribly wrong or it's Sunday or something uh, but otherwise I'm pretty quick about it so all right so let's get started in the next video uh, downloading the tools that we're gonna need for the course